game did not. <laughs> Rips a Roni. Oh my god. Well, well, okay, it says Minecraft now. Alright, we're good. Alright. It just took a second. <laughs> Well, welcome back to the madness, guys. Welcome back to another, well, good, good, and get wrecked for me, but it's another bingo card thing. The finish off this little trilogy, well, the last few of these that we've played. Uh, he won the first one, I won the second one, and now we're going on for, like, round three, so. So, uh, apparently going for the meme levels was really useful. Oh, he found something already? There's a village right next to me. <laughs> okay. Let's see what I what I, what I end up getting, but yeah, I guess we start now. So. Yep. First thing I need is a freaking thing of wood. Oh, it would help if I actually had the um thing up to look at the card. Ah, uh, yes, I have mine already shown, and this is going to be a little doozy. At least I made sure they you know no uh nether stuff. So, what we have, we should not need the nether for. Good. Uh, I didn't actually set up the card in time for the stream, so you guys aren't going to see it. But, I can. And that's what matters. Apparently. Okay, I got my wooden axe. Oh, I need apples already, because I was already damaged by the time I came here. And so, I'm already starving. What do I need here? Okay, I can get that. I can work that. Yeah, uh, I can work it. That's gonna take a minute. Probably get that, probably get that. That the can only, be done. The only thing I see that's like near me is literally like right next to me is some coal. And then that's my fun. But from the looks of things, uh. I think the easiest line was like fish junk, hang up three different paintings. Yeah. Bing, name a, finished by naming a dog uh, a wolf bingo. Two different diamond items. 54 hay bales? Oh, that's, that's doable. Where's the wheat? There it is. This music I have playing is weird as fuck, but it's something. I need to go and frickin' quickly get a bunch of, like, seeds, cause yeah, hay bales. That line doesn't look too hard either. It's the obsidian's the only oh. thing. 60, oh, fuck yes. 60 obsidian in a trap chest. How do you make a trap chest? Uh, you need a tripwire hook and a chest. Oh. Guess what? What'd you get? A bunch of hay bales near me. <laughs> Fucking villages. <laughs> you just start off with them. I had to grow them. I had to let's see if I can find a village. What's near me? Actually, yeah. Uh, I always like set up like directly right next to me. Let's just, let's try your method of like explore first. See what we get. Well, ironically, this one was right next to me, so it worked very well for me. Alright. I already have 25 hay bales. Half your hay already? Yep. Okay. Let me climb this mountain with a chicken on top of it. And I see absolutely... Oh, yes, wait, snow. Don't I need snow? Yeah, snow golem. Okay. Maybe... Great, ten snow golems? Alright. I was like, do we need snow? Golems. Golem. Golem. Yep. Golems. Gotty. Still don't got All any right. food. Chicky, give me nuggies. Can I eat snowballs for life? Uh, I think what, to make 10, you only need 20 blocks of snow. If I'm right, isn't it like two yeah. blocks? And yep. You 
10 pumpkins. Pumpkins will probably be the more harder things to get because you're probably going to plant them. Unless you like. Unless your place is like magically also a pumpkin farming village. No. In which case, I'm not life. that lucky. Not that lucky. I do need to look at this list a little more intensely. Well, you actually have a few more days to look at it, because I was supposed to, I was literally like 20 minutes away from, like, stream time, and then you're all like, okay, we gotta go, and I'm like, what, what, what? No, uh, I has the stuff to do. Okay. Oh. I, I didn't know you had stuff to do tonight. No, I'm not t not tonight, that was Wednesday. Oh. It was like 20 minutes away from our actual stream time when I got told I have stuff to do, and I'm like, are you, are you no, I told yeah. you Wednesday, I go, I'm busy Wednesdays. What don't you understand about nothing on Wednesdays? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to reload your... Okay, so these houses are completely useless, understood. Out of all the times to get lucky in the village, you got the most useless village of them all. Tell me about it. Hello, Fox. Let you Hang up do three that different Star four, Fox. four paintings. I could probably get some fishing done. Oh. Uh, I see watermelons. Bone blocks. Seven different edible items. Ooh. Well, I just fucked up on that one a little bit. But that's fine. Oh, Mr. Watermelon feeding my belly now. Oh, I need to reserve some of these for stuff later, but for Four. now I need to eat some watermelon. Oh wait, there's more watermelon over here. Sweet. Five. Forty watermelon. How much do I need? Thirty-nine. Hmm. Wait a second. Ha! <laughs> Wait, what? Okay. What's up? I see... I see a broken portal. Another portal. In Again? Front of me, and then across from it, like, is one of those raid towers. What the fuck? That's... Annoying. <laughs> That's twice now you've gotten one of those fucking... Stupid... Broken towers. You're the, one, portals. you're the one who chose my location. <laughs> I know. I <laughs> fucked myself on this oh, one. Oh! There's a ravine between me and that nether portal again. Are they just built <sighs> on... Are they literally just built on ravines? No, they're built anywhere. Just you're getting common ravine for some reason. Let's see, what's in here? A golden scepter of mending, flame strike, and thieving. A crossbow of multi shots and a fishing rod of magic lure, fishing three, and vanishing. Hmm. But I got potatoes and a gold a couple of golden apples. Nice. Well, I'm gonna need to get some tools yeah, so to start crafting. It also gave me uh, a few arrows to go with that crossbow. Just three though. Okay. For oh shit moments, I now have crossbow. Nice. Alright. Fishing rod, though. Hmm. That gives me options. As well as burning, thieving, sword, sept golden scepter. It's a sword, basically. Since I see so many chickies near me, give me nuggies! Why were you a baby chick? They do, fucked. Do chickens start off as babies? Before they, like, jump higher? I feel like that's the question of the universe right there. Well, there's plenty of sheep nearby too, I can start making wool beds. 
and getting my choppers. Mmm. Mmm. So good, choppers. Okay, I don't think I'm badass enough. Oh, that's a deep fuck. Oh my god. Does that go all the way to bedrock? What the fuck? This ravine is huge. And deep. There's like a ravine under this ravine, so it can, you can ravine while you ravine. Oh boy. Do, 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 do. Oh boy, I found me some sa salmon. Wait, yeah, I need to actually collect you. Come here, salmon. Oh, and I have... Golden Sword of Thieving. Give me. Oh, can you not die beds anymore? Fuck. Uh, I'm not sure if that was a certain very version of the game thing. Maybe that might be in Bedrock. Who knows? No, I think that was an older thing. That was the thing before they made it to where you can uh, color them with the specific wool. Because it used to just be like you get a white bed, but you can always like dye it for the color. Oh, so you need to dye the wool before we make the bed. Yep. Okay. I... There's some info for you. Do with what you will. I do have lots of sheep. I kind of feel like we should make a rule like we have to return back to like the place that we had to spawn to. Okay. It'll be a bit hard for when yeah. you go, like, on major adventures, though. Yeah, like, I know you do. I mean, that's kind of like how you play the, play this. I'm, like, I build, like, a foundation a play, and a base, which was kind of my, pro my problem, the very first one. You already got, like, a sheep? <laughs> yep. Your own personal sheep. I found... There's a baby sheep here. Hello, baby sheep. And other sheep. Damn it, and I ran past a bunch of iron so far, and because I, I didn't grab it, it was like floor, ground level iron on like a mountain. I was Eat. too concerned with going on adventure. Oh my god, and I also forgot to get the gold block on top of the nether portal back there. So I'm not sure. Yeah, I need a gold block for the middle flannel. Eat. Do, 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 chickies, give me nuggies. You shall surrender your nuggies. You're still baby chicken. Therefore, you so li live. Yo, daddy or mommy, I don't know. Actually, two chickens, they're both females, so. Bigs to differ. Oh, look, cow. Hello, eat. cow. Oh, I need. Stop walking and eat. I need steakums, but I also need goddamn milk. <laughs> Bango, am I right? Up top. He <laughs> yank it. So I decided to try it in VR by myself. Noped out so fast and now carrying a flashlight everywhere I go. I don't know why horror games scare me so bad, but really hard to scare me IRL. <laughs> Damn. Well, I got some stuff for magenta dye, I guess. Guess I need to pick these flowers. If you're gonna do VR, you want I don't wanna do it with like a group of friends. Hello, Ocean. Oh, wow, that was quick and easy. Alright. Ocean, why do you betray me, Ocean? Eh, gravity. Ow. It's a good gravity thing. Gravity sucks. Have, good thing I have lots of steakums. Oh ah! my god. Shut up. That hurt. Ow. Can you take them out there? Can you take them out there? Yeah. Oh. I don't want to fucking deal with them. Ah. Uh, Thank you. I just found a sunken. What do you mean no game? That was supposed to be there, Jay. I found a sunken ship. Fuck. Come out here. Come nice. On. Go. Go. Man, it's Come on. Come on. Go. Come on. Y'all don't hunt out the fucking bark, you get kicked out of my room. What's in the box? What's in the box? Don't or do Minecraft VR a lot less. Oh, shit. Yeah. 
I got a diamond pickaxe! Are you fucking kidding me? Hold on. It's even enchanted with stuff. Fortune 3 and vanishing. Oh my god. There's also a map of the area I'm in for a treasure. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, I guess these axes are kind of gone now. I got 28 with that. Okay. Oh, there's another box over here. What's in this box? Lots of iron and gold and lapses. Okay. Though they call lapses Azerite for some reason. Let's make... Let's make the whole world yum. Go. Wait, if I got iron, that means I can make a shield. And shields are important for taking on towers. Okay, grab that. Oh, hello, lava. Conspicuous lava pouring into a pond. Nothing to see here, apparently. Okay. Put this down. I need my sticks. Also, I got a compass for lols, like, apparently. Nice. Lol's compass. It was in one of the boxes for the treasure thing, but yeah. Oh, I can make arrows. I have more arrows. I have 18 arrows total now. Okay, buckets. I can only make two buckets. Okay, where was that? What the fuck was that? Three I think I just heard a wandering traitor or something, or a witch. Yeah. Yeah. I can get water and lava now for my buckets, and then go back for that cow. Since there's lava right here. Thank you. Thank you, water. Ten bone blocks, huh? Okay, okay. Yeah, that's definitely a witch. Which be gone. What's this? A blank map. Okay. Map so blank. Stick, you are my I mean not stick, uh Iron Axe, you are my weapon of choice. Golden Scepter is only used if I can actually, you know, get value out of shit. However, if I die, it's gone. I don't even think keep inventory protects from that. From what? Oh, the vanishing? No. Vanishing, it still takes away. Uh, I need to get more iron. I see so much sheep. There's iron near me. I'm just trying to get some coal and shit right now. I'm trying to get more seeds. Gotta seed the world. I'm trying to head back to my base camp area. Wow, okay. <laughs> One death Zombie already. Zombie has a sword. The zombie had a fucking sword. Came at you like balls fucking blazing, apparently. Well, I'm at a severe disadvantage already.
Thank God we changed it to five minutes from ten. Yeah, and next week I wanted to talk to you about an idea that I had for that. Need more iron. Need more iron. Need more iron. Need more iron. I hear an Enderman. Come for me. That's Squiddy. not iron, though. Squid boy, give me ink. Master pro tip: Iron is not Enderman. Oh no, he is Iron Man. But there is Do two Endermen near a bunch of iron. Do -do 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 -do. Found some iron in the water. It is floating away because some bastard likes to just mess with me. Ooh, eggs. If I can find some pumpkins, I can probably make some pumpkin pie. What the? F How did you hit me? Okay, I'm, I'm annoyed. Two down. Okay, there's the portal. Oh, wait, I can collect that obsidian for that portal now. <sighs> You know what, I'm not even fully mad just because the timing of the music that decided to play the moment I got pissed off was, <laughs> why you mad? And it's like, well, that's a good question. Oh, what the fuck? Why is there so many enemies here now? Dude, what was only two Endermen is now four fucking skeletons, a creeper, and two Endermen. What the fuck? Are you like near a spawner or something? No, they just spawned there. Bitches. Well, not getting the Enderman. Oh my fucking god. I'm gonna die again. I, I'm I'm literally about to just fucking call this a loss as is because I'm at two hearts and the skeleton is fucking shooting me. Oh, come on. That is one weird chasm that you have there, too. I have a weird one myself over here, but damn. I don't have time to heal. It's right there. I'm gonna put the shield down. I'm gonna eat. And I'm gonna fucking die. No? Okay, I somehow didn't die. Oh, fuck you for getting behind me. I was actually going to say, because, uh, let's save this for later, but I was going to say, like, after so many deaths, because it gave basically gave someone almost like an entire another hour to complete something, uh, do you want to just turn this into, like, a co-op bingo thing rather than a race? No, co-op bingo doesn't sound fun at all. Versus makes it fun. Co-op bingo just makes it... Another survival game with a friend that just has some a timer. challenges to it. It yeah. just doesn't sound interesting at all. Yeah. Go, don't you get behind my fucking shield, bitch. I've already died enough. Why won't you take damage from your fucking arrows? He only got hit once so far from his arrows. I'm literally bounding them back. Okay, twice now. How do you rebound the arrows other than... I, I, the only way I've known is you just... You block and get near them, yeah, and it rebounds it to them. That's the only thing. I, th I thought you made it sound like it's almost like Link, like you can use the shield There's at a certain three. time to like reflect arrow like 30 blocks away or I something. Wish. That would be nice. Oh shit, no! Magma block, why do you hurt me? Oh. Okay, four times now, five times now. Okay, I need to get back to my camp, which I believe Six. this direction. There's a horse over there. I don't think the horse taming's on our list of things. No. But damn, it is hard to hit, make the skeleton hit himself. My shield's gone! Rip. Come on. 
Today's just hasn't been your day for streaming or anything. I'm watching my footage at the moment, I'm still watching you just block this against the skeleton constantly. I'm going to have to make the executive decision that we're not doing the timer bonus on death because it's already pretty much 30 fucking minutes. Yeah, the thing I was going to say is like the the, the uh like if the opposite person dies you get to fill out a spot or something but then that makes like five deaths and the other person wins. Right. Honestly, I do feel that's a little bit better, because then if we do finish faster, but at this point, you've died so many times. Let's just complete the bingo and ignore death for this week. Thank you. I'll lower my rage quite a bit. I will say this, from your deaths and everything for a bonus for both of us, the turtle shell counts as a free thing for both of us, so maybe that'll open up some okay. options. Oh, just cracked my wrist. Yeah, that's probably a good idea, because I don't know how the hell I'm supposed to get a turtle shell. I don't no, know how that works. Name he <laughs> same here, and I feel like I need to fill out our own bingo cards, like, personally, but at the same time, like, the RNG bingo thing, it's just... Some of them, it's just like, I just don't know how to do, and they almost sound like you need to build your entire fucking farm, like, build an entire crop. Okay. What we could do for the next one is you put in like three different ones into RNG and then take out any of the ones that seem like they'd be a bitch to do and just Frankenstein the cards. Yeah. Because another one that I'm like, thinking of is going to be like a slight bitch is 60 Obsidian is doable, but god damn, it'll take a while. I mean, I got eight, and that took me, like... Well... It takes, like, almost an entire minute to get, like, just one block of obsidian. Yeah. That's also, I don't know how many arrow shots I need from the skeleton's own arrow to kill him. Oh, that's right. It's still in hard mode, too. And he can break your shield in, like... I think... He can break hits? your shield before he ever dies. Hence how I died I've, the last time. Yeah, I've managed to do it before by literally batting the guy in the head a few times before doing the shield trick, but... That's what I just did, but I just apparently I got him low enough with the arrows and hitting him already that the next hit pretty much killed him. And I'm like, well, that don't count. I made a danger cave by accident mining all this iron. Come on, Mr. Endy. Come down here. Hmm. I have a few letters here. I made him. I made him angry. I don't know where he is, but I made him angry. You've done pissed him off. Oh, this is a different type of obsidian. God dang it! Crying obsidian. Aha. Uh -huh. I, I have a few regular obsidian, but I have more crying obsidian, which doesn't count apparently because it's not obsidian. Yep. So, rip on that. Furnace. Invigorate Ow. me. I just had a skeleton shoot through an enderman to hit me. Oh my god. Pro Skelly. Dan and Merman and their stupid immunity to arrows. Okay, this waterfall has become quite annoying. I'm gonna have to fix this issue. Oh, that's an idea. What? Fixing waterfalls? No, making a waterfall for me. Protection fall? Oh, there's a cow nearby, and I have a bucket that needs filling. That'd be the first space I get to fill. Wait, there's one for milking a cow? Uh, 
thought there was. Oh no, that was, was last, that was last week, wasn't there? I thought yeah, it was a bucket, it was last week. bucket for everything. Never mind. This bucket's more useful for other things then. I had a skeleton come from behind while I was fighting a skeleton. Ninja skeleton, be all like, heard you like life. Be ashamed if I took that away. Dude, that cave I found is just not worth any bit of what I'm doing. Like, at all. World class cave of nope. Alright, I need iron shovel. And I guess an iron sword wouldn't be so bad. And then... Helmet. I guess I should go and get some, uh, wood. Build a crop of potatoes. Since I got some potatoes. Okay. Let's just make this stupid village my base of operations. Why not? If I ever get that tower cleared, that might be mine. And who knows how many times I'm going to die trying to fight that tower. And I just remembered that there is a blacksmith over here and I didn't need to make a furnace. Top furnace, bro. Actually, maybe don't want to make the tower my base because don't they just constantly spawn forever? Yep. So basically what I want to do is just bum rush up to the top of the area, get the box, and then run away. Pretty much. I only have one string, sadly. I thought I was going to get more from the first spider I killed, but one. One's what I got. More than me. Then again, I already have a crossbow and a fishing rod. Yeah, see, I need, I need the fishing rod. <laughs> That's part of my problem. You already got the stuff that you need it for. <laughs> okay, button is here. And since we cleared that out, I just need the cobblestone. Make it a button. Button. Button? Why button not appearing on... What are you trying to make a button out of? Can you not make a button out of cobblestone? No, it has to be regular stone. Ah, uh, okay. Or wood. Yep. Okay. That's where I went wrong. Okay. Get some and stuff wood. I don't need. Again, I still wish there was a way to get fucking, uh... Get to get the string out of wool instead of just turning wool into string and that being the end of it. That would be highly convenient, but yeah. I agree. That's kind of stupid. I mean, it's not too hard to take some wool and turn it into string. Right, just tear it a little bit. It's not that hard. And spin it. I feel like that could be another thing for the loom. Is just like also reverse your wool. I've come back to claim your life, coal. So that coal leads directly into an underground ravine. Oh my god! Underground and underwater. What is this pocket of death? Uh, with fortune. Oh, oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh oh. You say that, and I worry heavily for your soul. I almost put my win box 
into a death pit. Oh no, that would have been... You'd have Pretty to much get... I placed it right next to lava and I had to like build around just to get to it. Uh... Like, please don't die. Okay, since we're actually negating the, uh, the uh, death penalty this week... We can kill ourselves to get back to our our beds yeah. at least. Then, so then we will have to build uh, to make up for that. We will have to build like if we build a crop or anything, the bed has to be relatively near it, like within 50 blocks, kind of idea. Well, that's why I have all my beds here at the village. I've been placing them in a row. I have an idea of where I want to start making a farm that's a little bit... I need nine color of beds. I currently have five. Hmm. Yeah. I have wools, and I know we're sludge lots of sheep, so... I'm just making a bunch of iron right now, and we're gonna go back over there, and I'm just basically gonna set up near where the sheep were. As opposed to where I am currently. Yeah. So then I can start building more stuffs. Bonus of not having to worry about dying, I can go explore, and if I drown, I drown. Okay. Actually, there. I have not died once in, the, in any of these weeks either, so... I uh, know. But I, that's actually a little bit more of my playstyle to begin with, because I am more of a survivalist kind of person player. In general. I'm, I play defensively. Say so I play survival a lot, but I never play defensively. I Leroy Jenkins into way too many things. And honestly, I feel like that's the... Well, the first the first week it almost became your downfall because it almost gave me enough time to come back with a win. Yeah. Second week, it was your total downfall. Because you kind of died so much that you just kind of gave up. No, my, my downfall was just not being able to get to anything whatsoever and immediately fucking myself by the only amount of string I could get turning it into a bow not a fucking fishing rod yeah that, that was a pretty bad right off that the was bat, the immediate so oh I'm done it's over <laughs> that is the point I think I mentally just gave up okay so okay oh. A lot of that iron should be melted apart by now, and then I can head out, because I got like a bunch of coal now. I got some more flint, there's some more chickens over there. Give me nuggies, and feathers, because I'm going to be needing this crossbow for a while. That, and I can set up a chicken coop, if I can actually get some redstone, maybe even make a nuggie maker. Wait, is that a... Oh, no. I thought for a second there, I thought that cow was a creeper. Oh. It's like, wait, is the creeper above ground? Where did you spawn, sir? And considering creepers are still, like, insta-death. Yeah. Okay. This does require some level of sorting and leaving some. How do you get magenta dye? There's a certain plant, I thought, because I think I picked it up. I th think it's just a certain plant, yeah. Alright. Arrows. <sighs> Okay. I already have a silver bed, so that's good. Same with that one. So that's... Oh, that's the four I need. Alright, cool. I'm about to have my nine beds. I just need to go find that sheep I had over here. 
Beep, beep. Smixy sheep. Okay, I don't need the wooden pickaxe anymore. Oh, sheeple. Oh, it looks like I let the sheep out. What a shame. Who let the sheep out? Kenny. I did. I fucked up like that. What the fuck? Fuck the what? I found where the rest of the villagers disappeared to. Canada? They're all trapped in an animal pen. <laughs> There's all ran into one house and then... There's, There's nine of them out here. Damn. Okay. Okay, I'm now to head towards them sheeps that I found. Well, hi, big flower field, and there's a fuck ton of sheep. Okay, good. Well, aren't you a sheen sheep heaven? Indeed. Son of a bitch, I guess that. Need more chickies to give me nuggies. Mostly because I need nuggies for freaking arrows. Do, 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 do. <laughs> you literally just like. That is kind of funny and weird at the same time. Okay. Eat your fur. Eat. Eat. Each time you eat, 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 not eat. Yes. Okay, that should be the land in which I need over there. Where's something to eat? Grill the barbecue. Barbecue, barbecue ribs. Um, num num num. Okay, and then over here should be where all those sheep were. And with all this iron I have, I should be able to make shears like motherfucker. And then cut all them wool down. Thing was, is I don't know, semi remember this area. There's a horse. There's a cow. Hello, cow. There's a bunch of baby chickens. Use this steak to farm me seeds. Eat. Eat. Come on. Come on. Eat, eat. Eat or I'm gonna eat. Eat. Eat or I'm gonna eat. Why are any of you eating? Oh, well, it means I left some seeds behind. No. No, Mr. Cow, I need them seeds. I badly need seeds. Cause I... If I get seeds, I think I pretty much just need to get one more diamond item and I complete the final row since Turtle Shell ain't there. And you what? Because I can make a, uh, I just need. Well, I'm not there yet. It's just that I have the materials to make four different types of armor. I have the uh, one diamond item. Get another diamond item. Then I need the seeds to grow for to make the uh, to make the hay barrels. And I already have 39 melons. How? Where did the fuck did you get melons? I got them before I even found the. Uh, before I even found the whatchamacallit, the nether portal thing. I said, oh, well, look, melons. Oh my god. And since we're both cutting out that, I'm gonna put an X over the turtle shell. With both of our colors.
My biggest question is, can you get diamond items from the uh, raid tower? I don't know. I've honestly never... No, I found one once. Just once. And I don't remember what I got out of it, though. Is this the land of the sheep? Have I finally made it back? Yeah, there it is. I found land of the sheep. This is sheep world. Okay, and this this will be my kingdom. Setting bed down. Marking bed as home. Making wood. Treasure box, treasure box, tra 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 treasure box. Need about five of those motherfuckers. Okay. Gold ingots. Then I can have golden chest. What? I've been streaming. Hmm. Didn't tell me. Um, I'll leave it open. Maybe they can go back and forth. Okay. Yeah, I've been streaming for almost an hour now. Do 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 do. Guess I down my wind box for now, right here. Uh, I need to get the stuff out of it. That doesn't be. That's not so relevant. Oh goodness! I got one thing done finally. The bed. You got the beds done? Nice. Yep. Finally. Furnace, come here. Okay. Furnace, you're going to continue making me more, uh, smelting more of this. No, do not burn my crossbow. I need that crossbow for shenanigans. I need that. So I was on the phone with mom, it's fun. Don't worry about that. Uh, some trees. And cut me some really sheep. Uh, you can dye the wool, right? Yeah. As long as it's uh, just the wool. Where the fuck did the fish go? Damn it, come here. I'm having to get fished the hard way since I don't have any string. For the bed rule, since the ta beds take up so much space, should we just allow us to place them down on the ground? Rather than put them in the box? That's what I've already done. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. <sighs> Can you not just mix the colors of dyes to make, like... What just happened here? A house just randomly lit on fire. Today is the day I just decided to go. I'm gonna burn now. Like, literally, there was nothing in there to cause a fire. It's just on fire. What the fuck? Beep, beep. Like, the lava's blocked off from it, so I know that's not it. 
That's weird, man. You're having like hippie moments over there. Shit makes no sense. Beep, beep, blue sheep. Thank you, blue sheep, for making me stuffs. It's actually more beneficial just to die the sheep than cut it. Because <laughs> then you can get multiple for like one die. Yeah. That's what I've been doing. Three. Okay, red bed. Got blue bed. Incoming. Is it nine different colors of it? Jam. Yep. Damn. Well, at least we start off with one. So it's technically just like eight different beds. Okay. I ended up making ten. Ah. Uh, that does make sense, though. stuff away for now so I could use so I can get my fucking mind together here with all the stuff that I have oh my god alright seeds yes I'm gonna need you to come real quick wind box actually Put you down right here pull the seeds out from that cause I need to make a potato farm for some reason oh wait no because I need hay bales as well so I need like a mixed farm Need my buckets. Come forth, bucket. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty by four crop of fucking potatoes. Not just any potatoes, they had to be fucking potatoes. Suddenly the sheep are like swarming in around me. Like, what you doing? How'd you gonna plant stuff? It'd be ashamed if we come and ruin it. Just be, be exactly like dick sheep to do such a thing. Okay, Mr. Dick Sheep, if you're gonna be a dick, I'm gonna make you a yellow dick. The only reason I know this is yellow, though, is because the frickin' thing says yellow. <laughs> yeah. And then you, you will be pink sheep. Or magenta sheep, apparently, because I have magenta dye. I thought this was pink. Bink, bink, getting pink. Okay, now to sort the real problem out here. Get some more sticks. Seeds, seeds, seeds. I have a problem determining the, between the scythe and the goddamn sickle. Because like, sickles yeah. like flint and st the shears, but... Okay, so one, two, three, four, by one, two, three. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eight, eighteen, nineteen, twelve. Okay, that'd be a four by twenty space there. Going to need to make a hole here. Put water right there. Beat, beat magenta sheep. Okay. 
Okay, so... Now I gotta re-ho this parts that didn't want to stay hoed because no water. There we go. Got crops planted. Okay, where's my iron shovel? I guess I don't technically need it. I can just beat this dirt into submission. Okay. Good. Glad we figure that out. Do you already have a fuck ton of potatoes? Uh, I have like 20. More? Okay, I got like three, but I didn't have a village. So that village is definitely coming in for you. Yeah, but you're really close to finishing it, so I'm basically just trying to do something to catch up and maybe win. But it's not looking good. To be fair, it's still quite a bit of ways from me too. I just still need another type of armor. And actually, maybe I should forego the potato farm and literally go for hay, because I'm going to need hay. How much hay does it take? Is it four hay or nine? Nine. Ugh, that's... That's a monster. Yep. But all it really needs is one really big crop. To be fair. I'm hearing zombie noises. Not good. Yeah, that's about as good as I'm getting from that. So what have you completed in general? So I can mark that off. Nine colors of bed. I really can say is the melons right off the bat. Four different types of gold items, huh? I only have two, a sword and a uh, chest piece no, at the moment. I got a poisonous potato, cool. Oh no. Poison retribution. Okay. Only thing I can really hope for at this rate is something cool in the water. Cause if not, I'm fucked. And fish up, legendary fishing pool. <laughs> if I had a fishing rod, I would. Fine boat and water. Okay, I got four bed colors at the moment. Okay, what other beds do I? Okay, this might be pink then, and that'd probably just be white. Oh, great. I, I, Drown. I, I don't know how to make, like, non-chromatic colors, apparently. Oh, wait, no, there's orange right there. Okay. I thought you, need, you needed, like, because in Hexit you needed to combine different dyes to make colors. Yeah, you can still do that. Oh, fuck off, baby zombie bitch. Okay, original bed colors. Who the colors. fuck decided a baby zombie in the water was a good idea? Baby drown. Baby drown. He's a pain in my ass. And go down. Okay, you are now orange sheep. 
Come here, one sheep. Oh, thank you for the exact thing that I needed. Oh my god. Bed. There's a mine shaft. Get shafted, bro. Get shafted. You may have just found oh. your winning grace. Well, downside is I'm right here at a spider spawner, and that's pretty much going to kill me. Destroy a monster spawner is one of the things we got to do. I know, but to survive enough to do it is also kind of priority. Priority. Technically, we did remove the death thing, so... I know, I just gotta get to it, though. Just don't want to get all the way over here just to die and have to run all the way back here and potentially almost die again. Death circles aren't fun. Destroyed. Oh, thank God. Just like dreams. Alright, I have seven different color bits. Oh, there's a fire happening here. Oh, there's a lava pit. That's why. Thanks, spider. There, I got seven different types of edibles. Oh, right, I have that too. I forgot. One of the first things I went after. I completely forgot that was even on the list. Thank you. Oh, I do have blacks. Okay. That's a snow block. Forgot I got those. But let's make some black wool. Black dye. And where's my... Chest piece... Boots... And... Pants. Currently have full iron armor. I now also have golden shovel to go with my golden chest piece and my golden rod. One more gold item. That's good, that's good, that's good. Or is this useless? This away for now. This away for now. Or maybe not, maybe I should collect more while I'm out. And take this map, maybe I should finally go see what this map's about. Do not need the hoe currently, and besides, things need to grow. So, map. This was over by the boat. 
which I'm near the where the boat was anyway, because that's where I put my house. There we are. I'm on the map now. Shot by skeleton. Feels bad, bro. Oh. Yeah, it's fine. The dead just won't uh, leave you alone. They keep on killing you even outside the freaking. The assholes. That's all there is to it. I need another color, but for some reason won't make green unless I need a specific type of blue. You need to cook a cactus. That's the only way to get green? You can't mix uh, yellow nope. and blue? Can't mix. How do you get lime, then? Cactus with a piece of white dye. So, cactus, cut it into so, green. And, and and but anyway, I'm looking at this. I got this the wrong way. <laughs> yep. Here to the shore. This is my map. What okay. will it show me? What's in the magic treasure chest? I know this could be special because last time I got diamonds and like a heart of a fucking sea, so. Okay. I'm not gonna get bone blocks at this rate. I need to kill a lot of skeletons. Or a lot of fish. Like an, You basically need a skeleton fish. spawner, in a way. Pretty much. Okay, last time the treasure chest was buried in sand directly, not anything else. I'm going to dig up the sand first. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. I have a lot of strings, so I can make a fishing rod, finally. Would suck if this was like a cursed chest or something. Don't know if such a thing exists in the game. Nope. Over here. Uh, apparently, I don't have an arrow. <laughs> oh, yeah, I still have to do that. Cool. Let me go find Gravel real quick. Oh, Mr. Gravel running away from me now. Gravel? Gravel. Could it be a zombie with enchanted item? What? I'm trying to find this treasure box. It's it can be buried underground. It can be buried under stone? Yep. Okay, because... I've had it happen a lot. Oh no, and it's raining. That's always a fun sign. Oh, you got rain? How far deep will it be buried? Can it be like all the way to zero? Uh, no. I think it's anywhere between 6 to 16. 16 being the lowest. Like, it'll go down 16 blocks from the top. Okay. There's no rain here. That's strange. Unless I'm in this, unless I'm in this one chunk of ground. This one chunk of ground has rain. Because of the savanna. But I guess there's a piece of non savanna in this ground. Which is weird. Gravel. Yeah, it keeps I'd saying. like to get. Up. Keep saying I'm, I'm right where it needs to be, so. I don't know how big the hotspot is for this X, though, because the X seems kind of huge. Okay. 
Can you just break into flint, please, Gravel? I feel like I missed it somehow, but... There we go, fuck. Well, this map is lying to me. But I felt like the last one was lying to me, too. That's some suspicious dirt down here. Let's see. Feather. Stick. Flint. Button shot with arrow complete. Huzzah. Okay, where's that? Left Should side fourth it? on the bottom. Yeah. On technicality, right now I could probably do the one on the left if I go back down into that mine shaft. Yeah, you gotta clear that spider spawner. I found more iron. I still have not found this box, and I'm digging like a four by four hole, or basically it's a four hole, two by two by two. Damn, I only need like. One more piece of gold. Two more. Two more pieces of gold. I can do this. Yeah, considering this treasure box might have actually just been a doom thing, because I don't... I think I'm off somehow. I'm like all the way down at 21 now. <laughs> Wasting my diamond pickaxe. Okay, yeah, I missed this somehow. Because if you said 16 was the limit, I'm at 13. Yeah. It's usually like 16 under. Oh, it's a thunderstorm. And, yeah. It's the scary ton. I have a big hole for things to just fall down and die at. Okay, so... On top of that, that also cleared out several blocks that are around me of suspicion, because I was still a pretty good chunk that I just went down. Okay, so... That being said... Let's make this... Fill this kind of hole up a little bit here. Okay. Let me go in the water and see, I guess. Maybe water will show me a... Oh. I got stuck in a spider web and gang banged. Oh, man. Them spider gang bangs. Well, it's not a good time. Okay, what if it was over a little, like, right here? Okay, let's just do this. Oh, wait! Do golden apples count as golden items? Oh shit, if that does, then I also got it too. Alright, I say we count that. Okay, so then we both got the golden items. There's a creeper right where I don't need him to be. Hello, dolphin. Friendly dolphin. Oh. Whatever that works. So, yeah, I heard there's a creeper where you didn't want him to be. Yeah, <laughs> it really was. It was a great time. Clear that, clear that, clear I that. I feel like the storm's that. in response to me getting close to a treasure. He's too close. Take him out. Take him out with water.
keep saying it's that way, though. Like, exactly where the X should be, I literally dug. So... No, I'm just searching. I feel like it's still probably underneath the sand, to be honest. It's just so much sand. Now, oh, never mind. I was going to ask a stupid question. I was going to say, does junk items mean it's got to be, you know, all different items? But then I realized that that kind of defeats the purpose because there's not 25 different junk items that you can yeah, fish. Yeah, since they've nerfed the fuck out of what you can fish in general. Because too yeah. many people were going to, like, random realms, apparently, and just making, like, auto fish farms. Yep. And getting like top tier, like mending. Well, you you saw what happened season one. Oh yeah. And that was with actually trying. You know it's funny. First thing I fished up was a durability three lower two fishing rod. After all that hard work. Hello. <laughs> I heard Enderman is like port right next to me, then burn in in the freaking uh, rain. It burns my skin. Come on. Okay, maybe I shouldn't be using this fucking lore two fucking duration durability three thing because it is not giving me what I need. Lore just means fish faster. What you want is like look at the well, it's not look at the sea. What's it called? I I need trash. I don't need any luck. I just know I'm getting nothing but fish fish right now. And it's oh, like that's right. You game. wouldn't want that. You want the other thing because luck of the sea prevents from getting trash. Yeah. Which I think that's what lure is. Well, is lure luck of the sea or... Actually, I think luck of the sea just like raises your chance of getting good shit, not trash. Uh... I think you still can get trash with luck of the sea. It's just a lower chance. Son of a bitch, there's like no treasure here. I'm still fighting this and it's like one hell of a disappointment. Welcome to the fishing hour. <laughs> Welcome to the fishing hour. <laughs> King Pone edition. Hello, Skelly boy. You know, it would be, actually be sad if I got this all wrong and it's actually buried on the ground above the sand. Above this cliff. Honestly, though, that means I was like buried like 20 feet away from the fucking boat that I got it off of, though. That happens sometimes. Sometimes it'll also send you a thousand plus blocks away. I had one literally, I spawned it, and I. Alright, old Betsy. I ended up going fucking like 4,000 blocks in one direction before I found the X. It was like, Jesus Christ. It was a bunch of ocean. I found like three other boats on that trip. I just realized there's actually more freaking sand up on top here, too. Ooh, does pufferfish count as a useless item? No, they're technically, they technically count as a fish. But they are trash. I think the junk items are like, you said boots, bottles. Yeah, boots, bottles, rotten flesh, shit like that. Mm -hmm. Although, I personally would count puffer fish. I count them as a fish, to be honest, because they seem more fishy than trash. They're a living thing, and you can make them into nothing. You can turn them into traps. If you catch them in a bucket. Make it sound like it's impossible. And I've been able to put uh, 
fish into make poison water. Fuck. Why can't I make a shovel? There. I was wondering what the fuck. <sighs> okay. The junk you can fish up. Lily pad. Bowl. Fishing rod. Leather. Apparently a non-enchanted fishing rod. Not a enchanted one. Are you fucking um, kidding me? Oh, fuck me. Leather. leather fuck boots, me. Rotten fresh. <laughs> Stick, string, water bottle. Oh, I should probably not have my string on me. That will just make me confused. Yeah, I'm being attacked by rays. Oh boy. Bone, ink sack. I haven't got any new bones. I should just go put all this shit away. No geese, protect me. Okay, okay, okay. I can handle these. Son of a bitch! Oh, you're coming this way, huh? Huh? Ah, oh, triple shot, fucking crossbow, Stick. bitch. Stick. Silk. I just put all this way, cause I'm not gonna need any of it now. Oh shit! Killed you, bitch. And it got bright now. Ha! Now burn! Burn in the sun after I've killed only one of you. So let it be written. So let it be done. May you burn in the sun. Let there be slaughter. Hey look, turtles. Okay. I've cleared out my inventory of anything not fishable. Alright, back to fishing. Now that I have the list, tell me what, you know, counts as junk. Well, that's a treasure. I just got a name tag. Now you can end the game by making a wolf bingo. I finally me. found this treasure. It was on the cliff above me. Holy oh shit! Um. Yeah. Uh. Got lots of iron, diamond, um, TNT, and another heart of the sea. Oh yeah, and arrows apparently. Okay. Now all I need is just two different diamond items, though. I can make a diamond shovel and a diamond pickaxe, and then I'll have that. What the fuck? You hacks. <laughs> Take that to the blindness. You're the one who oh, pulled it up too fast. Uh, you're the one who chose my location, bro. I know. I thought my location was good, and then you started saying this. This is twice now that you've gotten lucky enough to get a fucking portal near you, get a fucking some other cool thing near you. Ravines. I still haven't even gone to the to the tower, to be honest. Jesus Christ. Uh, I'm about to go take that on, actually. But I need to figure out another color, because I'm just one color short. How do you make cyan? Is it like blue and white? Cyan, blue, yeah. Light blue is... That's what light blue is, I think. I don't know if that's cyan or not. Hmm. I'm pretty sure it's cyan. Oh, hello, Ender, bro. What are you doing out in the sun? Who let you out of... 
Let the ender bro out. Come on, fish. Ugh. Fucking puffer fish. Fucking puffers. Apparently I threw my fishing rod so fast that I actually hit the puffer fish as it was flying in my inventory. So the lure from the fishing rod just fell in front of me. <laughs> okay, now I've got silver die. God damn it. Could have swore there was a brown sheep around here. Put this in the wind box for now. Mm, different colors, different colors. I also have bombs of, at my disposal. Fucking hell, stop giving me treasures, I need trash. The one time you want trash. I got a fucking Nautilus shell, and it's apparently a treasure, and I'm like, God, oh, stop. Or puffer fish. That don't help me. Stop giving me puffies. Stop giving me the puff. Get a fucking puff puff pass. Wow. 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 Sharpness 3 Enchanted Book. Hmm. It's when I'm fishing for trash I get the good shit. What the fuck? Potato harvesting time. Boo, 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 boo. So I have a sad thing happen. According to... Uh, according to Mom, my game didn't arrive from GameStop. But uh, this... Slap mask I ordered like two days ago somehow did. Hmm. Which means I can't do my single player game tomorrow. Because I don't have it. Because GameStop didn't deliver it on the day they said they were going to deliver it. Honestly, GameStop has like completely. I've lost faith in it, to be honest, because of. For one, the printy game, which I still don't have, and it's impossible for me to collect his edition anymore. Yeah. So I am basically got completely ripped off, and all I got was like laughed at, so I, I can't even get my money back on top of the service that I was promised, so... Well, I can't get... I'm still fighting to get my money back, that's the biggest thing, though. It's Good. like, they're, they're constantly saying, no, I picked it up. No, I didn't. No. <laughs> because they sold it to somebody else, is what, yeah. and that's what they have. They sold something that I already completely paid for to someone else. Yep. Oh, even with floor two, fishing is taking forever. Another enchanted book. Come on, stop giving me good shit. Another sharpness three. I can make it a sharpness four. Cool. I need an actual. I totally want that. I, I need like literal white dye. Uh, well, I guess I can get stakeums along the way. No, wait, I just, I need leather for a fourth piece of armor. Then I'd have gold, leather, and, uh, gold, leather, and arm. iron. Wait, no, I need one more still. I need, like, diamond or something. Or chainmail. You can't craft chainmail, can you? No. Which you think you could now that they added chains to the game, but no. Okay, I gotta find that tower. Then I need bones, if anything, to help my crop grow. Literally, if I just can fish up 25 trash items, even though I only have three right now, I can I can win. This will be the end of my bingo. 23 trash items. Oh, yeah, you, 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 you actually destroyed that spawner. You never call, I don't think you called it out. No, I did. I was like, there, it's dead. It did. I, it's on. And that's basically because we took the turtle shell thing out of the equation. Yeah. 
Fuck that turtle shell. I just had a little right, game I'm gonna have to show the Did I see a dolphin in the water? Yeah. You seen a dolphin in the water. Being a nuisance. Dolphin being Oh, you're trying to fish and it's like Aah! and I'm like fuck off. It's the hyena of the water. It just sits there and laughs it, at you. It does. Okay, maybe I should not have destroyed my uh the end gate because it's hard for me to determine exactly where that was. Ah. This is the most like interesting gameplay ever. <gasps> just sitting here fishing. Damn it! I didn't bring. Dang it! I found a brown sheep. Oh. Oof! <sighs> I got steer. Is it 23 items or 25 items? 25. Oh, found the, found the tower. Okay. Did not find the other thing, so I'm gonna bum rush this tower now. 21 more. Do -do. Oh, these guys are gonna start shooting at me. There's water here, too. Hello, water. Okay. Eat my chicken. More than just chicken, I got some bacon and other things for the ride up, so... Get my shield, my sword, and just climb. Ignore everything else and just climb. Ah! <gasps> uh, oh, I got chainmail protection for, and a bow of an infinity bow. Fuck. And hey, not enough to make a bail though. So, how close are you to a bingo? Hold on. Do, 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 later. Um, I just need hay. Fuck. So the easiest thing for you to get while I'm dealing with the hardest thing I can probably get, because it's the closest I can get to done. Mhm. Mm just make a bunch of seeds and stuff. And I'm like set up in like a meadow. But once again, it comes down to like how fast can he grow? Yeah. Well, if you get enough bones pretty fast. Why does that count? Yeah, okay, cool. I have 5 out of 25. Technically, yeah, I just I can't get the monster spawner guarantee, so I'm not. There's no real reason for me to go for that line. Kill a skeleton with an arrow. Uh, I destroyed my gold block. Diamond block is just not happening because diamond's a impossible. Chicken eggs, maybe. Kill spider. Bookshelves, meh. Meh. Snow golem, maybe iron uh, the uh, obsidian blocks, basically out the window at this point because I'd take a literal hour to collect. Um, yeah, it literally comes down to basically hay bale versus uh, hay bale versus fishing. In all technicality, you would think fishing would actually be faster, but yeah. since it's specific types of items and they're not all so bad. There's only so much I can do to make hay grow faster. I mean, I guess the only other thing I could really do is run around and see if I can find a fucking village. But running around also puts me at risk of not getting my hay loaded up fast enough. Wait, what is this? Is this by a certain biome? This is by biome. Yeah, there's different biomes that produce different things, but they all... I know they all produce junk items, so... Oh, never mind. It's only showing me outside 
jungle and inside jungle, so I guess there's just higher chances inside jungle for shit. Yeah, jungle has the best fishing yields. Well, if I had a jungle, that'd be great. Isn't is that savanna in your distance, or is that jungle? Savanna. It's the biome I'm still in. It just stretches out that way. Oh my god, come on. I guess I could try to do the book thing, but that's gonna also require... Oh, hey. The nearest jungle to me is 4,157 blocks away, also known as too fucking far away. <laughs> Next year away. Come back for part four when Kenny actually gets to a jungle, but it's already lost. Oh, wait, I already got black sheep. So with my magic stick and the sword of slaying cows, if I can get enough cows, I might be able to get that other lineup, but that still requires me to make a shit ton of goddamn potatoes. I wish you could actually, like, get villagers to do their stuff instead of just, like, standing there. Like a fisher villager. I would love to see them actually standing there by the water on a pier with a rod in their hands and a bobber in the water. That would actually be cool. They actually, you know... I do wish they they have villagers do just more than just be stupid little guys to run around. Yeah. I mean, I hear I hear legends of villagers that can do other things, but I've honestly have not ever, ever oh, even seen bees. Come with me. Help me fertilize my plants. You make plants grow faster. Yes. So the legend goes. Yeah, if you break their hive, they'll follow you. Easy. I thought you just had to hold a flower. I mean, you could do that too, but you don't have to hold a flower if you just break their hive, because they won't like break off from you and track back to the hive. The hive will just not exist. Hmm. Don't, don't actually break the hive. I was being mean. <laughs> I couldn't keep myself letting me do that. It will make them angry at you and attack. I haven't tried, I'm just thinking, I was like, huh. Because I, I, the only thing I've experimented on was like in the tower with beehives. And I will admit I like spawned a few of those in, other than the ones I, I gathered two from outside our house that, were ju that I just left floating trees with beehives around, but... Apparently, uh, you have a chance of a tree you spawn with a uh, sapling spawning a beehive. Oh. Didn't know that. Hello, yeah, bee. Yeah, me neither. I found that out the other day. Happy bee, smiling with its eyes. I've been watching a lot of uh, Minecraft block facts and shit like that. And tips and tricks you may not have known. Hello, and there's spinner. a lot of things I didn't know. I learned how to make a sentry tower. Nice. That literally shoots enemies, mows them down. New recipe unlocked. Wait, spider eyes make a different type of die? Spider eyes... Oh, I just got a saddle. That's treasure, though. Fuck me. Uh, spider eyes make fermented spider eyes and stuff, and they can be used in potions. Apparently, they also make yellow dye. Huh? Uh, put spider eyes in socket. Oh, wait, no, I have flowers. That's why. I was like, why do I have yellow dye unlocked? I was about to say. I thought those were white flowers. My bad. I was like, what is this madness? 
Come on. Well, I seem to have lost where my base camp is, so the best way for me to get back is to kill myself. Luckily, I don't have any of my vanishing shit on me, so... So, die. <laughs> oh boy, you, you love that. Didn't you? I do. <laughs> I'm here to help. <laughs> alright, alright. So... I lost a fishing catch for that. It was worth it. Worth it in one zone mine. You know, technically, if you count, like, the golden apples, then golden nuggets and golden bars are completely different things as well. Oh, my God. I pulled it out too soon again. Pull out game so strong, I'm pulling out way too soon. <laughs> oh, man. Sounds like... Not even letting it get, get close. It's just like, nah, don't trust it. <laughs> don't trust the steam. Don't trust it. Okay, well, the sheep thing doesn't really even matter at the moment anymore if I can't even get that line in general. Ah! So, my only other choice is to either fish for bones and pray. Yes, fish for bones. Or go digging for stuff. If you go to the nether, you can potentially find a soul sand valley which has bone blocks. You do have a point. So, go to hell, Emery, get it. <laughs> get that fucking grind going. I do have the obsidian. I have five obsidian, I can't go to hell. Or I probably would have already. But then I also had the problem of it's not growing out here in the real world. Yeah. It'll be fine, you get the bone blocks, it'll be good. I wish you can turn fish into bone somehow. I mean, if you kill the fish swimming around, they have a chance to drop bones. I do have an infinity bow. Ugh. I am... I don't have the patience for this. This is killing me on the inside. I only have fucking six items out of 25. Get me who has made entire, like, fucking streams based off just actual fishing, not even the AFK fishing. Yeah, I can't do that. I, I'm not good at sitting still. Well... Let's see, you do have the option of finding bone blocks and cooking a cod and salmon for a win. For a win? Yeah, you have, there's, co yeah, 24 cooked cod and, 20 th and 30 cooked salmon, and then there's just get 10 bone blocks. And you can complete that line as well. True. <laughs> Only downside is, I don't have enough bones and I don't have a way to get to the nether. I mean, I can always give the shot of just swim around and kill fish. I do have a golden scepter of thieving. Ugh, alright. I want to go over here to my blacksmith and put some this shit away and... I could also try digging down until I find That's darkness. Cool. My old friend. Well, I was going to put these uh, enchantment books together and put it on my sword for bonus damage so I can insta-kill shit. And, um... Yeah, I realized I don't have an anvil. Or enough iron for an anvil. Hmm. Yeah, I'm sitting here with so much iron. Yeah, I got 11 more iron bars and only one iron block. I wonder, if I use my fortune pickaxe to break, do I get more? I would need literally another, like, 11 bars, wouldn't I? Let's see. 9, 18, 20... 
22. Yeah, I would need another 11 iron bars to make an anvil. Oh, I think that does work. What? If I use fortune to break the wheat, I get more. I got like a hell of a lot more seeds. Oh, fuck. Like, I broke two and got ten seeds. Me. I should really just give in. I'm not going to win to Emery. Also me. Nah, that's quitter's talk. I can fucking do this. Emery. Yo, I found this thing that's going to make it easier for me to win against you. Me. I should just give in to Emery. Nah, let's go in the cave and find some iron. In the back of my mind, I'm a fool. All you need is to do the fishing ding, really. But you don't want to do the fishing ding. It takes too long. I only got six items out of 25. You'll have the hay done by then. Honestly, I wasted too long doing it as it is. I should have just come and done this from the start. But I didn't realize that I could. Yeah, honestly, from the start, I was like thinking, I'm like, I gotta set up the hay farm. I got since that since the first week, I've always been set up hay farm, set up hay farm. Wait a minute. What the fuck? What the fuck? Fuck the what? Why do I hear Piglin? <laughs> You've been next to the nether portal this entire time. Is that a legit Piglin thing? I thought that, like... Zombified Piglin grunt! What the fuck? Yeah, I've heard that, like... They, they have random chances to like invade the world, especially after you defeated the Ender Dragon. You can get random, you know, the broken Nether portals. There's places where the Nether portals are actually set up, like underground and shit. What the fuck? I thought it was. I thought it might have been a mod or something because we've never seen it, but. I didn't know it was a thing. Like, he's just here. There's not even a portal nearby him. That was he's actually, just here. That was actually on Game Theory, even. Talk about piglins. <laughs> and, like, disease and shit. Sir, how are you here? Where is your portal? Oh, you know what it is? What? I think a pig got sapped by lightning. Oh, that, that's technically also another way, so, yeah. Yeah, I think that's what happened, because there's no portal anywhere nearby. Okay, what did I, I need all this hit on? Like, on there? Oh, that's not happening, that row. That's not happening. Alright, so hey ain't gonna help me for shit. The hay and the seeds are what I need, and I've got plenty of seed generation at the moment. Can we go grab that pickaxe again? I see some more that need to be popped. I'm doing the dance of faster everything. Well, <laughs> Ooh, yeah, like to, okay. It doesn't give you more hay, but it does give you a shit ton more seeds. seeds. Yeah. Look, I broke four and I got 21 seeds. I before I think I only ever got like three seeds from breaking plants normally. Come on. Come on. Almost got enough for two hay barrels. Bales.
All right, I don't have looting, but I have sharpness. Let's fucking go. I guess my plan B in the meantime is to make an underground skilly farm by making up like just enough darkness area for monsters to spawn and, and hope to god that there's skeletons. <laughs> Uh, as soon as I surfaced on the water. What a shame. Oh, never mind. There's an underground cave right here. Full of darkness. My old friend. Maybe I didn't have to do that. Time to go cave splunking. Since death doesn't seem to be a thing. And it's right underneath my area, so I technically am not moving anywhere. Oh, wow. Most of my wheat just grew, too. Oh, yes, gimme, gimme, gimme. Did I just get bone meal from the fish? Yeah, you can get bone meal directly from fish, I believe. Fuck! I need bone, not bone meal. What the fuck was that noise? I just had the demons reach out to me, Emery. They're telling me to come home. Take me home. Demon O to the place I don't know to the place torture belongs West Hell I'm not getting bones from this. I know you can get bones from fish, but I'm not getting bones from fish. This fish is a bitch. Fish bitch. It's also hard as fuck to hit them. Yeah, it is. I will not lie. Oh my god. I killed two f fucking flowers and got fucking 30 seeds. So I think there's a chance of like 15 per fucking thing. Jesus. Yeah, I'm not getting any bones. I've honestly, they're rare. I've done it, but they're rare as fuck. Way too rare. Okay. So here's what's gonna happen shield. Throw the shield on. It'll have to do. I mean, the only thing I can do at this point is just constantly expand my seed plantation. Not here. Over here. Plant hay bales. So far, three hay bales out of, what, 50? 54. 54. I just looked over at it. Yeah. <laughs> Need an entire, almost an entire fucking stack. How many do you have? Three. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's progress already. The thing that's actually working in my favor is the fact that we have infinite day.
expand my... Normally, I would be super happy with our infinite day plan. But... I need to kill some skellies. That's the only way I'm getting any... Okay, next time we'll... I guess we'll turn back on the day-night cycle. Because there are a bunch of these things where we need to kill, and that kind of screwed us over last week as well. Where a lot of our options, like, for you, it was literally you didn't have the string. Fuck. Yeah. And the string, you can't literally get any string otherwise, so... So next week, we'll do turn back on... Well, not next week, because next week I'm going to have my wisdoms removed. Yeah. So the next one will be past, past Valentine's Day. Or a couple of awareness day, however you want to view that day. Single person awareness day. Ah! Second most suicides of the year. I contribute. I'm like Kenny from South Park. I kill myself, but I come back. It's a curse. Well, that's why I made you that Kenny South Park thing. People have made that joke so often that I actually wonder if, like, it's a you legitimate are cursed. thing. <laughs> <laughs> like, I, I never want to, like, test it, but I swear I've had so many near death experiences where I should have died. That I'm starting to believe it. Believe me, I have like near same problems in my life. It's like you should be dead, but then there's like the Mexican healing factor kicks in. Yeah. And you're like, oh, oh. Which coincidentally, there's actually a theory going on about the uh, Fallout, right. the That's Fallout okay. ghouls. They're all Mexicans, or have Hispanic, or have Hispanic descent. The only one that's like meh was the one that that was, had like the Minnesota accent from new from uh, Fallout Three that instantly got turned into one. But she has an Irish that thing. But she could technically have some kind of Hispanic descent or Latino descent, descent, uh, whatever heritage. Yeah. So the joke of the Mexican healing factor could actually be. Ghoulification in Fallout World. You're not gonna die, you're gonna become a ghoul. Brr. And we're talking Let's like talk the, we're not talking about the feral ghouls, mind. we're talking about the ghouls that actually stay for like ever as like humanoid. Yeah. Give me some slabs. Return the slab, or suffer my wrath. No. What are you paying? What's your offer? Stupid dog, you got me cursed. There's just no skeletons down here. No skellies for the billies. I have four bones. Skeletons there's, always sound like, you know, in your mind, you always think they're the easiest thing ever, but in reality, they're actually pretty rare. Yeah, it's really annoying. Zombies are the most common thing. And spiders. Third of creepers. I seem to be seeing everything but skeletons. So many creepers. I don't want to talk about the perfect time for that. <laughs> we talk about everything <laughs> but skeletons sniped. All right. <laughs> I'm actually more impressed with the sniping skills of the of skeletons in this game. They're so ridiculously overpowered. I know. It's stupid. <laughs> Why is there no like locate skeleton spawner command? <laughs> Because the skeleton spawner isn't even a block you can, like, normally get. You have to get, like, into the special coding to usually find it or actually be standing next to it to be able to, like, have this block in my hand. Ah, <sighs> oh, boy. Okay. One hoe down. <laughs> Oh, hey. There's a ruined portal near me. Dun, 
dun, dun, dun. Fuck it, let me go to hell. It's time for the hell adventure. Cause... I would laugh if I spawn in a fucking, uh, soul sand valley. Just fossils right next to me, ready for the fucking... It's like, you, it's like you go in there. Reality is you're on, like, a flying island. Above, a, like, 500, 5,000, another 5,000 lake of lava. All over again. Ugh, Cause that would, that That would be our luck in this fucking reality. That's just nightmares you just gave me right there. That's... That was that's PTSD. Technically, we lived through that already. Oh, PTSD my. nightmares. I love them. Flash. It's great time. Bro. All right. <laughs> Bridge plane clear. Cry your eyes out. <laughs> I now have a farm of like 200 plus fucking seeds. Sir, sir, what are you doing up there? Sir. Do a flip. Do a barrel roll. I have a villager on top of a tower just standing there. Okay. 48. 418.56. It's been past two hours, but this isn't still our longest bingo. Our fir the first night was the longest bingo, because it went nearly yeah. three. Extra taters, extra taters. Make hash browns. There's another piglin here. And another one. That's so weird. I've never seen Piglin in the overworld. Unless they've come through my portal in my house. <laughs> so, many, you, so many pigs have been zapped near you. You summon the powers of Zeus. 48. And then for 1856, I can do this. Is it more water produces more th things to grow faster? Uh, no. I didn't think so. One block of water will do a uh, nine by nine area if you place it in the middle. Emery, my nether portal is underwater. How does it light on fire? You open it up, the hell gets just completely flooded and, and vaporized. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the water starts fighting the lava, and it's like, yes, no more lava. No more lava. No more lava. Just die. Have you ever been watching Dr. Stone? Nope. It's literally like Minecraft, that anime. Yeah, I've been meaning to. Because <laughs> just talking about vaporizing, like, fluids and whatnot, they, they literally went through, like, there's an acid lake that he has to go through. And, you know, acid that vaporizes, gets in your lungs, just instantly kills you. Yeah. They had to, like, make gas masks to go around it. Okay. What is it? 56? Eight blocks away. 56. Behind me? No, this way. And for the lulls while I wait, I'm going to shoot this button with this arrow. Oh, look. Eh. It went a little too long on that thing. 56, you said, right? Yeah. So it's right above me. Wait, is that a spawner? Or under me. Oh, no, I gotta check this out. I think I might be next to a monster spawner. Of zombos. If I break, then I'm on the same lane with you with the junk items. <laughs> I 
It's either that or I continue to expand my farm while I wait. Giving me... I'm so confused. I'm not finding this portal. And now I'm underwater again. I'm literally on the spot it is. Hmm. I'm at bedrock. Something, okay. something lie. Apparently you drown. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this. It says it's in the water. Like, in the air in the water. Hmm. What the fuck? Is it just not here and it's just one was supposed to be here but overlapped with, you know, ocean? Probably. So I wasted my time. Welcome to Kenny Wastes His Time. It's a common theme of a lot of my streams. And my life. Well, at least yeah, you don't... Uh, yeah, at least you don't have to rely on something like watching plants grow. At least fishing's a little bit more interactive. I'd rather watch plants grow. I have enough for the hay bales ready to be plucked at the uh, village. But I don't have anything in that line or the potato line. It's like, stop. Well, I do. I have shoot a button with an arrow. That's it. On that line. The one on the bottom there isn't going to help me either. There's no way I'm getting any diamond items at this rate. I only got, like, pretty much lucky that I have, like, four magic treasures. Here. Alright, back to my original plan. Back to fishing? No, I'm gonna run over to the, um, what is it, the mine shaft and see if I can't get bones that way. <laughs> well, I do think they spawn a little bit better in the mine shafts, to be honest. But I think that's more of a personal theory rather than anything else. I haven't actually, I'm not one that goes diving into like the data files. Yeah. I'm just gonna speed my way into this fucking mine shaft. Whoa. Hacks. Dude, it is trippy if you go into spectator and go underground. If you're like in watery zones, it's trippy as fuck. Anyway, into the mine shaft. And not into a spot where I'm gonna drown to water. That's the last thing I need to do is speed my way down here and drown. That's a dead end. Put myself in a pit. Yeah, no. Not the pit. Not the pit. The pit. The pit. All right. That's useless. Bunch of lapis around me. Those aren't skeletons. Lapsus isn't skeletons. Silly game. That's not what we need. Silly game? You don't know what you're doing. Oh, cool. And my pickaxe just broke while I'm down in the mines. Worst time for that to happen. Well, since you did a little meh, I'm gonna use 
Yep, go ahead, so do a little meh. I'm gonna see if this is fair. if this is only if this is a uh I just wanna know if this is a mine shaft near a, I mean a spawner near me. So That's fair. Spectator. And that allows you to like fly through walls and shit? Yep. It's really fun actually. Well, there is actually a mine system underneath me, and there is a spawner, yes. Nice. So, now, the question is, what kind of spawner? Spider, I think. Oh, sadness. Yeah, that, that's a spider spawner. Well, still a spawner, so that's nice. Just seeing if there's... There's like several sp uh, spider spawners actually. That would give uh -huh. me, that would give me that line though, and then all I have to do is just fish like you. Yeah. All right, back to survival mode. Hang on, if I do this, does it tell you that I went into Spectator? Yes. Okay, I didn't know if it did or not, because I was like... I never... I, 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 yeah, yeah, I'm not doing... I'm not... Uh, yeah, I didn't... On, on top of that, I don't usually use it, so you don't get to see other people use it. Yeah, so, it, like, I wasn't sure if that's what was happening or not. I kind of just wanted to know. It is. That is the thing. Dude, there are, like, no enemies around here. Like, I kind of just want to find a spawner now. Because there's no way. We're both so close to it, it's just like, get me there. If I can find one, then I can go and I can dig toward it instead of just spawning myself there. Well, considering a, you've also had a lot of just I've spawned there moments, saving you lots of time. Yeah, I've also had a lot of bad luck in these things. Apparently, bingo games are not my thing. Yeah, the thing is, I haven't done any of that. <laughs> no. You so, also haven't died six, so, six or seven times. Would it be fair if I go breaking. creative mode just to dig a tunnel to this spider spawner? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Hey, if I'm cheating, you can cheat. It's only fair. I'm not going to say no, you can't when I am. <laughs> I'm just making this a little bit more even, considering you've done this, like, a hell of a lot of times now. Yeah, I have. So, I'm just going to... I'm literally just... I'm not even, like, looking good enough. Like, I've flown past diamonds. Like, I'm not even bothering. I'm just, like, flying around underground, looking around like, is there a fucking spawner anywhere yeah. here? The thing, yeah, the thing is, you're, you're get back. This is, you've saved, basically all you've done is save time. You did not grab resource. I, this is just me going to the beginning of the tunnel to a spawner. Yeah. To make up Where for the... the Fuck. Almost the exact amount of time that you did it. I, I do have resource to go down to this thing, so... I'm going to I have resource too. I just need to find one. Oh, there's an Enderman. That don't help me. There's literally no spider. Anything about spider spawners. That's all I'm finding is spider spawners. Like, okay. give me, give me Skelly Dungeon. I need Skelly Dungeon. Okay, so right here. So then we go creative mode. Well. Welcome to Kenny is losing his mind so bad that he's literally flying through walls to find things and still coming up empty. Kenny coming up empty. <sighs> All right, I'm flipping back into survival mode and putting back my action bar. I have not gained. There. I, well, I've gained one one candle. One whole candle. 
compared to what I didn't have before. So, Emery, there is a bunch of ravines, but no dungeons. I've flown for so long. <laughs> You know, the sad part is I'm still relatively near my, my beginning location. I've gone so far away from mine just because I'm not seeing anything. It's starting to get ridiculous. Like, I'm gonna I found another mine shaft. Okay. This is like the fourth one I've seen. Okay, before I even attempt these... Guys, uh, my field needs tendon. Oh, that's a zombie spawner. God damn it. I forgot they're not lit either, so I've been looking for lit areas, and I've probably flown past so many. I think the I spider spawner, spawner wasn't though. too hard to find, especially when the spiders are it's like glowy white. <laughs> yeah. Whiter than the vo whitest void. Yeah. Now I'm looking for dark spots. Dark squares. Oh boy. So much wheat. Grow in the hay barrel bales. How many hay bales? Ch -ch -ch -ch. Uh, up to thirteen hay bales uh, now. So much fucking seeds. But now I go to break the spider spawner. And then I introduce myself to a whole new kind of demon. <laughs> Fell from high place. Oh, I flew up in the sky and killed myself. I wasn't finding shit, so I'm giving up. Die, spider spawner. Okay, my, I have slain the spider spawner. Beaten the spawner. What's in the boxes nearby? Any bones? No, we got hail. We got armor, horse armor, gunpowder, creeper dust. No bones, though. Sometimes you find bones. This is a golden apple. Guess that counts for something. I'm just watching you fly in spectator mode. I'm not sure if how the far back that is, because I think this is the, you're like an entire minute behind. I was up to three minutes behind on the um, phasmophobia stuff when it stopped smoking crack. It started working. Like it was bad. Okay. Fish twenty-five junk, and I can do that while also going, waiting for hay bales. Does the horse armor count as a different type of armor? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I wish. No. We did that for the first. can't wear it. That first time thing, but that was when we were like doing a co-op thing, trying to figure some, find something out. Like, yeah. No, like, no, 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 not not that. It was uh the uh, har the hardcore mode thing. 
Our goal oh, yeah. was to get complete, complete, uh, complete diamond armor was the goal. It was complete diamond armor, but it was for a horse. <laughs> we kind of fit, kind of played ourselves in that. Yeah. Downside is this one says wear four different armor types, so we can't wear a horse armor that, type. And, and that's what I was saying. Like we should do like that, but bingo card, like hardcore mode. We die, the entire world universe vanishes. It's like, okay, we're just getting started. And it's like two, like two seconds in, you fall off a cliff and die. Well, the world's screwed. <laughs> yep. Here we go again. Regenerating world. Oh boy. When you have like a fucking... I don't know the exact blocks at the moment, but I have lots of freaking hay going on now. Wheat, my wheat farm. Be smoking. You know what would be an interesting thing I would think we could potentially do? Oh? Uh, commands are allowed, like, uh, locate fortress and shit so we can find the nether, the end fortress and shit. But you and me create our own separate single player worlds. We stream at the same time. And we race to see who can defeat the Ender Dragon first. We spawn in, we go to get our iron, we go get our gear. We run into the end and we try to beat the dragon as soon as we're fully set up. So you basically is a full it's a full Minecraft race. Yep. Straight on, get your shit, kill the dragon. But we can use commands to find the dragon and shit. You mean find the find, find yeah find the fortress the stronghold? I would yep. th I would think how we'd do this is for one it'd probably be like a full on stream day so like a six to oh, yeah. nine hour thing. It would it would be a definite like our original mine and chill ideas where we were like oh let's do it for like six hours, do that. Okay, so okay a, six, a long stream like that, and I think how we start off is we both we'd get at least like something to start off with for one. Just to help us out, like a Roxy, basically. Yeah, uh, we're gonna get a. Yeah, we're gonna get pretty much that. Like a Roxy. But it's, and not, sh it's not gonna be like a God one, though. It's gonna be like an Iron version of Roxy. Yeah, yeah, Iron Roxy, which I can yeah. make probably previous for us. And then uh, I think we should have perhaps one of every color shulker box just to help us out. Or. An entire bar of yeah. one colored choker box or something. You just basically you get like nine choker boxes to help move things, so we move forward. Yeah. Um, I'd say that keep inventory should still stay on. Yes. The last thing we need to do is just you know get yeeted by the ender dragon and lose everything. Mm -hmm. So yeah, keep inventory on. We'll both get a choker box. We'll both get an iron roxy. And we'll both use our locate command to find the nearest stronghold, and then it's. I think we go. should. I think we need to actually uh, get to a certain point before we activate that command. Like, I think the command should only be like once you've like gone to the Nether and found a Nether fortress or something. Yeah. Because then you can use the command to find it, and then you can use the command. It's to just make like it. you know that you have it, so as soon as you get like, okay, I'm ready for the dragon slash locate fortress. <laughs> And then at the same time, stronghold, I mean. you locate stronghold, you teleport to the location, use creative mode to grab eyes of Ender and just throw them in the souls, activate the thing, then go fight the dragon. Nope, we gotta get the Ender eyes too. We, we gotta get the Ender eyes. Okay. Ender eyes too. So it'd be way too easy so, if we just poof them in. Okay, so we literally have to do everything but find the fortress, which will be yeah. given to us. Uh, the only reason I'm okay with us teleporting is because of how weird they can be. Like, I would hate for it to be like, oh, I'm ready to go, but my fortress is 7,000 blocks away, while yours is like 200 blocks away. And it's like, well, guess who's going to win this race? <laughs> mm -hmm. 20, so, yeah. 21 hay bales. Uh, you've almost got how many I've gotten just from the village itself. My thing is still technically growing and growing and growing. I'm pretty sh I'm pretty sure I can just call it now that you've won. We're just gonna see if there's any way I can overcome 
the odds at this point. Because the odds are pretty much 90-10, you're winning. Still gotta wait like one hell of a time though, because I think even if I, I, the only way I think I'd win is at the at this point is literally if everything in my thing turns into wheat within like a few minutes. I mean, how many how many fishing things have you gotten? Uh, that's what I'm gonna find out. I'm actually gonna do this. I have seven things. Yeah, I just put a uh, shulker box at my little fishing spot for me to just put the items in. Uh, so I don't have to clutter my inventory. I was about to do this, almost the same just with a, reg with a regular box, to be honest. Because I just started fishing while I wait for all my things to grow. That's literally what I need to do is what I'm waiting for at the moment is just this goddamn shit to grow. Yeah. Go get wood, grab some stuff. There we go. Yeah, can I just eat all of this away into here? Okay, I'm gonna put stuff in my inventory that I know I can't get from fishing. So I know what is fishing and what isn't fishing in my inventory. There. Where did it go? Okay. I lost my string. Oh no. Not your string. Yeah, I think I might have placed it on the ground. Or tossed it in a really weird spot. Either way, it was gone. God dang it. I came here with the box, and then I suddenly realized I put the box in the wrong box. For the box with the wrong box? Uh, I grabbed, uh, basically I gra accidentally grabbed uh, gold instead of my box. No. Oh. This isn't Hexit, we can't have golden treasure boxes, damn it. <laughs> Not with that attitude. Until Mojang decides to cl start cleaning up their shit. Add more shit to the game. Which they are, I will admit, but... It took them a long time to add, like, new stuff for just the nether thing, so... Yeah. Yeah, they added... Go, go figure this one. Nether was, you know, the first new thing, and then they added the end, which was like, oh, look, a new new thing. And then the end got an update before the nether got an update, and it's like, what? Mm-hmm. I mean, it wasn't until we actually cleared the end the first time that I even realized that they changed the end. When you told me they added like the other thing with the elytras and stuff, yeah, I'm like, what are you even going on about? And it's like, what the heck's a shulker box? I mean, I remember you saying something about that when we first started playing, but I didn't realize it was a box that like, like basically it functions like a portable chest. Yeah. Which, I mean, I used to use ender chests like this pretty much until they added those. And then I used those and ender chests to make mass storage just easy for everything. I would always have an ender chest on me with a silk uh, What I really want just... is Hexit's backpacks to be a legit vanilla Minecraft thing. Yeah. At least give us a backpack. That'd be nice. I wouldn't even mind if it took over the inventory slots and just made it like, oh, you have a backpack, so uh -huh. now you have 50 slots. Yeah, so you actually, yeah. 
we actually had the backpack and then you put down the backpack and then get like another backpack so you, it just makes the, it, it, it a backpack would would just i wouldn't say break the game but change the game so much i could just finally yeah. got my first thing and it's a lily pad they're trying i'll give them that the bundles thing is definitely a step forward but it's the tiniest step forward and it was a very weird step like, they took a step, and their ankles went left as they took the step. They're like, oh. They sprained their ankle. <laughs> We're going to put backpacks in the game somewhat. Here's a bundle. Oh, my ankle. On it, honestly, what, what they could really do and make actually the game just a hell of a lot is, is basically, you know how Shulker Box works? Just do, yeah. just have barrels do that. Yeah. That, that, that just be, that would make sense. That would make sense for one, because barrels were known as a mode of transportation. Just you know, make a barrel an easier shulker box, and a shulker box be something a little bit more permanent. Like a shulker box, maybe like constantly teleports with you, even if he like if as if he had to keep him in tour, even if he died, or something else a little special. Like maybe even have bigger thing. Like a barrel is just a one block box thing, and a shulker box is like a full chest, right. a double chest. I mean that would make, that's the only thing Minecraft's missing is just like an inventory a better in inventory management system rather yeah. than just chests and if you could just expand your inventory which is like the number one mod everyone looks for too I mean, if I I've been looking at like all those mods like Hexit and all that it's like the first there's, there's two things that they go for either like an easier like tool system like diamonds or they go for an expanded inventory of some kind oh yeah and diamonds for tools just instead of what instead of just weapons and whatnot okay hey bales another eights down Bring one of me. the mods I like to look for back when I was thinking of doing mods was stuff like, um, you know, emerald tools, new ores. Oh, I just remember, heck, well, I just remember, uh, Tech It before emeralds came Still out. Minecrafting? Yup. Dude. We're pretty much at the end of the race. It's just whichever one he gets finished first. Between. I either am going to finish my fishing before him or he's going to finish his hay bales before me. Which I'm at 29 out of 54. Yeah. I have a lot of wheat together right now, so I'm working on that. I got two more fishing hooks, by the way. Uh, trip wire hooks. So, yay. Progress. Can you add, like, what, nine? Uh, I'll double check after this fish. Oh, I got a bowl. Hang on. Is bowl a treasure or a trash? That's a good question. Bowl is a trash. Ba -ba -ba -ba. We literally had to bust out a fucking list for this. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have ten items now. Out of twenty-five. Yep. Fifteen more. And they consider a fishing rod a trash item, which kind of funny because I fishing was... rod, yes. Enchanted fishing rod is treasure. Oh, so basically anything enchanted is treasure. Yes. If it's not enchanted, it's considered trash. Okay. Unless it's a Nautilus shell or a name tag. They're not enchanted, but they're treasure. And a saddle. Saddle's also not. Yeah. Because it's only like a few ways to get a saddle. Right. Either through an already existing treasure chest, either in a mine, a village, or a uh... nether fortress. Yeah. Or get it from fishing. Yeah, or fishing. Reminds me, I still gotta get back on uh, the misfits. Bedrock world. Me and Matt are pretty much like the main two people. I think his brother Drew. Drew, do you play on that server? By the way, there's a 
the starting town was like half destroyed, half not destroyed. Like it was a zombie village, but also a regular village. It was weird. So <laughs> he filled up all the holes with dirt where all like the spider webs and stuff was and called it new old dirt city. <laughs> and now there's like this giant dirt mushroom thing that's there. And I'm, I'm confused by all of it, but I have a house there. I'm working on making a nice house. 40 potatoes. Hmm. I can technically make that potato line. I'm going to make that century thing on there. I can make that potato line too, but it don't help me none. Just like the hay bales don't help me yeah, none. Yeah, I don't have the bookshelves. I do have the chicken eggs though. I mean, hell, I actually, uh, I just need some redstone, and I could even make the chicken, uh, the ch the auto, an auto nuggie farm. Auto nuggie farm. Oh boy, auto nuggies. You know, one of my favorite auto things nuggies. to make. Auto nuggies. I'm still like a little over shocked about how good the auto nogi farm <laughs> saved us this uh, during season three. Like, well, not even saved us; it like literally kept us going. We were living off so many nugs. The fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> yeah, he almost made me destroy my farm. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just thought that you were fishing, so I was gonna make your like vision go. Woo! Oh no, I was I was on the cleanup of the farm thing. Oh. <laughs> technically, a, a non-cooked cod is technically an edible item. Yeah. And now I'll go fishing. Wee. Technically, a poisonous potato is an edible item. <laughs> yeah, if you can eat it. Puffer fish as well. Uh huh. Why is tropical fish not edible? I don't get that either, honestly, because I tried, th that was like one thing in one of my, like, I think it was my like hardcore run, I'm like, I keep getting tropical fish from fishing. It's I like a completely useless fish. Oh, I feel like there should be a <laughs> you know what you could You know what you could have built? An auto fisher? I don't know how to do that. Um, also, on top of that, I just realized you get better, you get better trash shields if you, uh, the less of a, the, you basically don't go in deep water. You get more trash in, like, one to three feet deep water. You're right. You're right, I say. I realized this myself just now because you said it. I forgot they did that fucking update. If it's a case, it's a covered, uh, not deep area, you get the shittiest of water. Yeah. The shittiest of water. And I just thought about that because of Auto Fisher. <laughs> to be honest, I'm like, wait a second. Auto Fish gives you shit items all the time. And you've been just fishing in, like, lo uh, in the ocean, haven't you? Yeah. Been, fi been fishing in the ocean. I think the only thing about the auto fisher though is that you need one. You need to make a note block, which requires, I believe, at least one. Uh, one redstone. You've actually. I have redstone. Which I haven't gotten because I didn't really make a. I didn't dig much. I mean, the only thing I dug was after you've already did a bunch of teleportation and scouting. And for me, it was just to a spider spawner. Yeah, I was trying to find a skeleton spawner. I could not find one. So I gave up on that. So technically, me going into spectator and scouting did nothing for me whatsoever but waste time. That I could have been spent fishing. Get fishing, bro. Get fishing. When all else fails, go fishing. Fishing probably should have been the first thing you did, to be honest. 
I, I couldn't it, get a fishing rod right away. Yeah, honestly, the first thing that I've noticed in these bingo runs to get set up is either a, to start just fishing or to get, like, a seed farm. Yeah. Because get a farm going and get fishing going is the best thing you can do in the beginning. And then after you fish a little bit, because you can get string from fishing, make a bow. Yeah, or goes. you can just get a bow from fishing. Yeah, that too. Oh, if it's enchanted, even better. Yeah, especially bingo runs. Oh boy, I think I'm gonna practice some more solo bingo things after. Well, I, first next week is gonna be like sucks for me because I mean it's already been sucks because my teeth work that's been needing to be yeah. done, but that needs to be done before I actually move. So a lot of this stuff just is a need to do, and so I'm gonna fin finishing up my teeth work and. I know next week is just going to completely suck in general, and I'm not going to want to even open my mouth. Because my life sucks, because I keep regrowing my freaking wisdom teeth. And keep regrowing? Yeah, they, um... Okay. Bit of a family backstory here. When my grandmother was pregnant with my dad, she started taking these hormones because she was losing her hair. Like, her doctor gave them to and whatnot, but she didn't realize she was pregnant yet. And, basically, that ended up fucking over my dad, like, my dad's genes or something. Uh, because what ends up happening for us, like, our family in general, including what happened to him, which he went through, apparently, uh, six sets of, uh, wisdom teeth in his life. Jesus. Uh, it seems, it seems like what ends, what happens is our, like, fingernails, our hair... And apparently, wisdom teeth grow back like every seven years or so. Jesus Christ! So yeah, it, it completely sucks because our hair grows re about two inches a month. Sometimes a little Probably. slower, but it's it's still pretty bad. I mean, it's more it's more obvious if we dye our hair because I used to dye my hair a lot. It's just that yeah. it was really obvious when I just like you just dyed your hair and yet you already have like two inches underneath of growth what yeah, yeah. When, uh, when I was younger I used to have the hair thing I would grow my hair so long like I, when I was like, three I had hair down to my ass like it was long ass I, hair I, I could put in a ponytail I was born with that hair that, that yeah. length of hair I mean, when it's like stupidly long and when I was young yes I had it like in a ponytail at all in fact I was mm. con they, I was confused for a girl for so much because my name, my name sounds feminine enough as it is, since it's very not. My name don't even sound feminine, and they kept thinking I was a girl sometimes until I started growing facial hair. Even actually, facial hair saved me from that. Actually, even in high school, I had that problem where apparently one of my teachers, my uh, economics teacher, actually uh, thought I was a girl. Until I spoke in like one audio thing, and it freaked him the hell out. Jesus. He actually threw me into therapy at that point too. What the fuck? Yeah. But basically, long story short, if you're pregnant and you think you're losing your hair, well, if you don't know if you're pregnant and whatnot, double check in case you are, because oh my god, they, uh, the fingernails are also the the nail part is a bitch because that causes ingrown problems as well. My yeah. brother has had to have his toenails removed twice surgically oh. because of the fact that they've gotten the ingrown problems are just that bad. I, I have it. I have to cut. I, I figured out how to stop at least for me. Is I uh, people will notice automatically that my nails they look like they're filed been into sharp points. No, I cut my when I clip my nails I clip them into triangles, like forward. I yeah. So that the end part, the, so that the edges don't curl up and go underneath the skin. So basically, um, when they grow out, which they grow out very quickly, I, I cut the I clip them and they basically grow. Um, I would say almost a centimeter a, a week. That, that's Jeez. how fast they fucking grow. Um, so it almost looks like I constantly have, like, pointed claws. Which, my thumbs actually are kind of handy, because I can, like, rip open packages and do other things. Um, that are That's pretty handy. Um, originally, it was really handy for when I played card games a lot, because I can, like, flip through, like, a deck of cards and count the cards. 
Yeah. And whatnot, like in the, the and everything, but uh, other things are like uh, when you get a package in from Amazon, you just pop your nail in and rip it open. <laughs> Don't need no box cutter. So it, it does come in handy some things, but a lot of the times it, people think you're a crack addict or something. Right. Because long pointy nails. Uh, that's that's not what I have them for, but. And, uh, but uh, they're, on, the, on the side note, unlike uh, my, uh, the rest of my family, so I'm actually kind of more blessed with uh, my nails are still thin as fuck. Where if they were thicker, it'd be, uh, they'd grow out a lot thicker as you grew older, and that'd be a problem. Instead, I got my mother's nails, which are thin and flimsy. So, win, lose somewhat, because they're not going to be thicker, so I can't do anything better with my fingernails, but with my thumbnails particularly, but uh, that's why my brother has problems, because he has like really thick nails, and I also have really thick fucking hair, like every time I go to get my hair cut, I usually have to like make sure that I don't get charged for fucking breaking a, a buzz blade or something. <laughs> because the hair is just really thick and dark. Up to 49 hay bales. Jesus. Every time I turn around, you know, more and more of these things have been popped out, so. But anyway, you got some story time there. I mean. I don't got stories. Um, And also regarding some problems is like one of my half sisters, uh. She actually, I think it was her, uh, one of her, I, she was on her third set, but I think it was like one that didn't actually, uh, a wisdom teeth that didn't actually come out. Well, she only had like one that didn't, but when it came time for her third set and another one was growing underneath, they literally had to, because it was the, the new tooth was growing in weird, because there was already a tooth, a wisdom tooth there, uh, they actually had to cut out like a part of her jaw. Jesus. Just to relieve her from pain and shit. I mean, you can't see it from the outside, and it doesn't really give her problems when biting or anything. It's just the back of her jaw. She had to, like, have a little chunk removed with, with like, a, a knotted tooth basically going through her jaw. Oh. So, the, these things are crazy. And I know I'm the oldest out of my siblings. So that did, and I'm now getting my fourth set removed currently. And I'm still sitting over here hoping to God I don't have to ever have my wisdom teeth removed. 51. Oh, well, yeah, you're about to have this. Considering. There's no way you're not. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen out of twenty-five fished items. Also, I could have been expanding this farm even further, like hella, hella farther. Because oh yeah, you I, could have had it long time ago. I, I literally just kind of stopped and just went with it because I was thinking of like fishing or something. Yeah, I mean, shit, it's two a.m. as it is. Um, yeah, we're pretty much gone for three hours. Oh, I'm gonna call myself. I've lost. You only need four more things, so I'm gonna go grab my stuff. Yeah, I I got upset of Panda Express tonight because that was stupid. By my beef and broccoli. Oh boy. Um, here's a entire thing of just broccoli. Fif yeah. Fifteen dollars, please. I'm just like, are you what? Is, you have beef sauce all over it. This is true, and the broccoli is barely even freaking cooked. It's, that's annoying. And then there's also the problem where I ordered Angus beef uh, and didn't get Angus beef. I think there was no... The only beef I got was beef and broccoli and it didn't have beef, so all their beef thing was is technically a lie. A lie, good sir. How dareth you. It's so, a lie! But then again, a lot of things here... I, I don't know. Uh, California has just gotten stupid in all frontiers when it comes to either, like, fast food, because they're like, oh, we're... Uh, Panda Express treats themselves as if they're, like, the only ones providing food for the entire world. 
Because now they have it where if you try to buy more than like a certain amount of like the large boxes or whatnot, they start charging yeah. you like super amounts of money for each box. Where you can buy like I think the limit is four. You buy four boxes of food, and if you try to buy any more, it's like fifteen bo- fifteen dollars for all the boxes, including the ones that you had previous. Where otherwise they're like seven dollars a piece. Because there were, I guess there were people that just like bought just shit tons of Panda Express at certain points, like hoarding, Jeez. just like. But I don't get what the point of uh, treating it as if it was, you know, uh, the world a rare world, item, the bit, the like best commodity, and fifty six hay barrels. So whole, I guess I gotta teleport you over here now. See this. Oh, you already did it. Okay, there's my wind box. Okay, actually, I gotta put back on the armor pieces because it says I have to literally wear these armor pieces. So, we got four different types of armor in terms of. Oh, wait. No, shoes. Okay, there we go. There we go. Chicken and broccoli is better, Mom says. <laughs> Maybe I didn't win because I fucked up on one part. And then James put in a bunch of rupees. I need just slightly a little bit more leather, apparently. Because I thought... I do have four different types of armor pieces, but I re misread the part where I had to be wearing them. Where all I'm missing is leather pants. I have, like, leather shoes. Oh. I just tossed you a pair of my leather shoes. <laughs> and I have... Uh, hold on, let me grab my... I have a... But anyway, there's two different diamond items in the box. Um, the hay barrel, bales and the uh, melons thing. So I'm just gonna... Yeah. Well, we'll just say you won. You can have my pants from my box to wear real quick. They're golden. I just gotta kill a cow, to be honest. But yeah. where Where's a cow? Do you see a cow? No. I know there's cows around here. I just uh, I see one cow over there. Maybe that'll be enough. One cow. It's gonna drop you how many leather? There's two cows. Uh, how much it's leather? Seven is pants? per pants. I already have like I think it's either four or five. I already have in that box. There's it's in the box back there. No, I have four right now. Six. I just there's another cow. Seven guaranteed at least because I think you're guaranteed at least one leather. Even Not always. Though. I've killed a couple cows, but I've gotten nothing. So I got in seven. All right. So I just gotta make me sexy little pants, and then that's it. We gotta put it on since we give ourselves the free turtle show. Ah, speed. Leather pants. Okay, so I got helmet of iron. Chest, chainmail chest, leather pants, and golden shoes. So that's the four. Two different, uh, the pickaxe and the shovel. The turtle shovel is given for free. The hay bales and the, and the melons. Alright. And now we have, like, a super goddamn wheat farm. <laughs> I'm gonna flip creative mode. There's also the... Meh. I was trying to fish a little bit here, but the wheat was needed so much attending to that it didn't even matter. Yeah. So, I'm gonna stick the coolest things that I've got inside this box over here and put the wind box over in the tower. I'm not getting anything out of that. I mean, I did get a lot of iron. Here, let me actually show you. Teleport you to the exact location I was. Um, here, I'll just tele it teleports to me in just a second. I'll grab the wind box. Technically, the heart of the sea is also another cool thing to have. Uh, bucket, bucket, bucket. Map, treasure map. All right. Okay, so I'm going to teleport to where my area, where our starting area is. So teleport to me. 
This is where I started, okay? And we're gonna go fly exactly to where I ended up being, where... I went this way at first. This is where I started digging some iron that was in the wall. And directly... I see your chest. Yeah, that, that's, that's where I left the iron. And then I was literally pounding around the ground, uh, getting stuff the seeds because that was my first concern and I remember down over here this is where the melons were like off the off this water bank and when I looked over this is where oh, I see the tower in the room yeah forward. yeah the, 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 I was just like I was this is right where I was standing I'm like there's a tower over there and then there's a portal Jesus. and I went over here got the portal stuff there's even the stam ravine that is still here that I never even touched where are you Oh, there you are. Like, it's like another ravine underneath this ravine if you look down that way. Oh my god. It's like a double ravine. But I saw the portal in that... I know the portal was over here, and I saw the tower in that direction. I wanted to go the opposite way of the tower. And plus, look at all this. This is just like Seed City. So I literally right. just kept going this way, pounding this grass for seeds. In the in oh my this is my this is where my feet wheat field is this is where I ended up settling because this is where I found Sheep City which I still have a bunch of sheep still around <laughs> different colors and shit and I ended up hitting the ocean and I was coming over here this is also where the treasure was this is the treasure box but I ended up over here where I found the uh, oh the ship above water all right yeah. Yeah, there was one, like, underneath here. Like, there was a box down here, which has had the diamond pickaxe, and then... Wow, hey, Emery, there. if you would have gone a little farther out, you would have found another ship above water. Oh, my God. What's in it? Because we gotta see what the fuck I fucked up on. Uh, it's on its side, so it's a little harder to tra traverse. All this fucking sand. Ah, chest. Uh, coal, potatoes, suspicious stews, poisonous potatoes, leather pants, and fire protection too. Hey, there's those leather pants. <laughs> yeah, those would have been the leather pants I needed. Look for another box because I found two treasure boxes in the. Ah, sorry, hit you. I think. This where the it's water is. There. Which one's where's the water? Okay. Uh the issue is that. Hmm. It was a submerged block that became a solid block. There it is. I found it. Is there a tre is there a treasure map inside any of these? Yep, treasure map. Let's see where the treasure would have been. Because if I would have found this, I want to know. Oh, look at this treasure map. And then there was books, too. Okay, treasure map. We are not even on this map, apparently. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's this, this way? It started clearing when I went this way. Oh, would not funny if it led to the exact same treasure? They've done that before. Okay, so I've literally gotten five treasure maps, and they all led to the exact same treasure. So yeah, it is the exact same treasure. Yep. So that would have been the same outcome, Heart of the Sea and whatnot. Which I've now gotten two Heart of the Seas. And just in general. But just the fact that you not only found the one, but you didn't even see the second one near you is just Jesus Christ. Because I honestly, uh, I thought my 42069 was lucky. Yours was luckier. I honestly, from this distance, I love and everything. Uh, this place it wasn't full really that rendered, and I thought that might have been looking at the color. I probably would have thought that was dirt. <laughs> yeah, probably. I mean, unless you the, accidentally combine the maps. No, uh, 
Usually when I get my treasure from my map, I literally throw the map into either a box or throw it away. So every time I got a new map, it was fresh in my inventory. I'm, and it still led to the same thing. I'm big wondering if there is a... Uh, well, here's a jungle. But I was just wondering if there's a village nearby and if I really needed to wait for all that fucking wheat. If I could have just gotten lucky going this direction, you know? Oh wow, there is a jungle here. This is actually... Oh my god, there's a jungle temple. What the fuck? I haven't seen one of those in forever. Dude, teleport to Where me, bro. Where is this? Yeah, I'll teleport to you. I got it. Oh, I see it. Never mind. There's even watermelons in the jungle. Unless we're at two different temples. Uh, I don't see you. Uh, We might be at two different temples. Holy fucking shit. I mean, let's scope around for a second. 42,000 X. Yeah, I think we're in two different temples here, bro. Oh my god. So, here, let me see where am I at exactly. I'm at 42k to negative 331. Uh, 42k, negative 41612. 4161? Yep, 41612. There are two diamonds in this chest. You're like 300 yards, you're 300 away from where my location is. So there was two temples within 300 blocks of each other. And I could have actually, and oh my god, there's a freaking skelly spawner down here, I think. Dude, uh, there were two diamonds in that. Yeah, and let me see what's in this box. It looks like it's trapped. Nope, there's a lot of bones! Okay. Yeah, there was a lot of bones in that one, too. Would have oh. definitely helped out. Oh my god. If I just would have looked a little bit further. But I didn't really even leave home. Yeah. I'm looking for you in the temple you found now. Like, from the sky to see just exactly, like, how far from where I was. I'm looking at my temple. So I also think I'm gonna flip the thing back onto a look a little more of an easier mode for because the, the, it seems like the harder difficulty, the more. Yeah, you, hard mode's kind of making it a bitch. <laughs> it seems like, well, at least for you, it just seems like. Yeah, for me specifically, me, I am not having an easy time. <laughs> You're somehow like it's hard mode, but you're getting like the lucky shit to appear it's for like you. Three I'm over here, four my shit wrecked. Four treasures right next to me, and then there was even more treasures, like just a little bit off on that, like another hundred blocks away from each treasure. There's more treasure. I mean, you had you you actually spooked me with the uh, with the what you call it right off the bat, the village. And I'm like, oh great, now it's time for the the roles to be reversed. Yeah, uh, Emery, go back to your temple that you found. Okay, I'm coming. We I see you. It's lava. Oh my god, there's another nether portal right here. That's not lava. What? Yeah, another broken nether portal. Oh my god. That would have been... And all this in here is golden shoes, really, and more obsidian and iron scraps. So it wouldn't have been the best, but yeah, the potential is there. I mean, if there's a gold block, that would have been even more bread busted, actually. Right. But I don't. But so come up here. So you see your temple right there, right? Hold on, I fell down because I double clicked jump. Oh. So your temple's right there. Yep. My temple's right over here. Like I said, it was only like 300 blocks away yeah. somehow. You can. You can I've, no, if you I've never do even it right, heard. I'm looking for yours. I've lost so. mine. Yeah, I'm looking for yours. I've, so. I've done this so many times already. I've lost it. Oh, there it is. I can see it again. Okay, yeah, I found it. But yeah, uh, it's literally a straight shot too. Like I've I can just go straight this way to it. I've never seen these in vanilla Minecraft. I've only seen like variations in like Hexit. But even. I've come across these, but I haven't come across these since fucking 1.12. On top of that, there's two very fucking close to each other. This is also a huge jungle, actually. Oh, yeah. 
Actually, the last time I came across these was on PS3 Minecraft Rips. when they first launched it. Rips a Roni. Let's see what else we can find real quick. Just the glaze over the land. Well, I don't see much of anything. There's oh, a village. village. You say, and then there's another, another pool. Yep. These seem to look like swarm to me. And there's a clock in there, and there's yeah, there's so juicy. many of the. This whole box would have just gotten you the whole four different gold items thing. No yeah. problem. Apparently, clocks count as well. So. Yeah, because they're made of gold. This, Golden rails also would count. This, this fucking look at oh, this. Got yes, this is like one of the ultimate villages. Oh my god. I wish I could take. No you. blacksmith though. There's hay barrels right there. Yep, a bunch hay of barrels. them. There's set over there, set over there, uh, set back there. What do you have? Set here? right there. There's four sets of hay bales here, dude. I... Five. Five sets. Uh, I had to, like, painfully grow mine. <laughs> that this is some bullshit. <laughs> yeah, I know. It just... Mm. Mm. I mean, this is, what, right. this is why villages are actually, like, super important as well for these bingo races, because they just... Oh yeah, they have a, um, tre just finding treasures in general are, is important. But yeah, Emery, this, there's a ravine under this village. Oh my god, it just keeps getting more and more crazy. And I, again, have to remind you, you're the one who chose the locations. <laughs> I I know I made the mistake of choosing the positive, the negative 420 instead mm -hmm. of the positive 420. <laughs> I would have had so much better luck if I went positive. Honestly, I kind of want to go to where yours was in track, so semi-track your journey. Because I just... Oh my god, I found another broken ship. Alright, so... I hope you guys enjoyed the bingo. I'm... I'm yeah, I hope you guys not are... too happy with Minecraft right now. Uh, I yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this, this stuff. You uh, know, you know, if you did, you know, maybe leave a like, maybe comment down below. I don't know. It hurts. I'm not your dad. Can't tell you what to do, but I do hope that you have a good one, and we'll see you next time. All right, bye bye. Don't don't let Minecraft hurt your soul. Bye.